Hi, I'm Kiara with Moving Minds Dance, and I believe that we can learn all things through dance. So today, we are going to dance about letters. When we read, we know that we have to understand the shapes of letters. And when we dance, we make different shapes with our bodies. At home, to do this activity with me, all you need is your body. I will have some pictures of letters that we can dance together. But if at home you have pictures of letters in different languages or alphabets, I would love for you to use those too. All right, let's start with our dancing shapes. There are three ways that we can make shapes when we dance. Straight, curvy, and zigzagged. Can you make three straight shapes with me? One, two, three. Awesome. Let's make three curvy shapes. One, two, three. Wonderful. Now let's make three zigzag shapes. One, they get to bend back and forth. Two, three. That was so much fun. When we think about letters, we can see that they have straight, curvy, and zigzag shapes too. Let's look at a few of them. What letter do you see here? That's right, it's the letter T. Does the letter T have curvy shapes? No, it's got straight shapes. Can you make your body straight like the letter T? It's got a line up and down and a line side to side. What about this letter? That's right, the letter O is so curvy. Can you make your body round and curvy like the letter O? There's more than one way to be curvy. Your way might be different from mine. This letter even sounds like zigzag, Z. I'm gonna go down low to make my body zig and zag like the letter Z. How would you make the letter Z? All right, now that we've looked at a few different letters, I am going to have a guessing game happen. I'm gonna make a letter with my body and I want you to guess what it is. You can play this game wherever you are with the people that are around you too. Maybe it is um, a letter that you make and you have someone else guess, or you can have someone else make a letter for you to guess. But here's the first one. What do you see in this shape? Do you see a straight line up and down and a curve to one side on top? What does that look like to you? That's right, it's the letter P. All right, I'm gonna do a few more. What does this letter look like? It's wide on the bottom and narrow on the top. It's got a point and a big band across the middle. The letter A, good guess. All right, I've got another tricky one for you. What do you see here? It looks kind of like the letter P. There's a straight line up and down and a curve on top, but then it's got an extra little zigzag leg. It's the letter R. All right, last one. <laughs> it's narrow on the bottom and wide on top. The letter V. Do you think you could make that letter V with me too? It's tricky, it makes all your muscles work hard. All right, we have one more game to play. This is going to be a game called freeze dance. When I say freeze, we're going to freeze in a strong letter shape. And when I say dance, we're going to make that letter dance in a movement that starts with the letter. Let's start with our straight letter T. Are you ready? Freeze. And when I say dance, we're going to tiptoe. Ready? Dance. Tiptoe, 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 tiptoe. Freeze. S. Can you make the letter S? Freeze. And we're going to spin. Dance. Spin, 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 freeze. Can you make the letter J? 
that's kind of tricky. And when I say dance, let's jump. Jump, 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 jump. What if you jump on the other leg? Jump, 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 jump. Okay, the letter K. Freeze in the letter K. Now, we're going to kick with the letter K. Make sure you can do that safely wherever you are without kicking anyone or anything around you. Ready? Dance. Kick, 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 freeze. All right, last one. This one takes a little bit of space. We're going to make the letter L, however you choose to make the letter L. And we're going to leap. It might have to be a little leap or you might have space to do a big leap. But wherever you are, do one L leap. Ready? Dance. All right, I didn't have a lot of room, so my leap was little. That is all of the dance games that we have time for right now. I hope that we'll get to play some more and dance again together soon. I'm Kiara with Moving Minds Dance, and today we danced letters with our bodies. I hope that you can take some of these ideas and dance with them in your own life. You can put letters together to make a word or think about different letters in different languages and alphabets that we didn't talk about today. Have fun and dance again with me soon. <laughs>